So at two o'clock, I had to get up with my pajamas on, walk outside, the car sat outside, it didn't have, we didn't have a garage, start the car up, let it run for 20 minutes, <laughs> warm up the water, <laughs> shut it off, go back upstairs, crawl back in bed, and go to sleep. I did that a lot of nights and stuff like this here. It's funny I didn't fall asleep in the car <laughs> and end up being down there all night. I'm going down my line of thinking. I'm going to teach. In some place he got in his mind that he's going to, he wants me to stay. But he didn't, he didn't forecast it. And nor did I really see, i tell you the truth, I didn't see the job. In the wedding business, all the competitors, it took two weeks to get your wedding order. So Glenn says, we're gonna turn orders around in 24 hours. It, it was fun, actually. It was very, very challenging. There's always something new, and I think that's what made me stay. Never a dull moment, ever. Leaders, and this isn't just Glenn, leaders lead by example. And he, he always worked harder than anybody. We call it a mission statement to provide opportunity and security for employees. You know, in today's vernacular, maybe that isn't quite strictly a mission statement, but it was for us. And it guided everything we did. Uh, whenever we looked at an acquisition or an investment in a startup, it was, um, could, could this take the company down? And could it put us in a place where it might endanger the jobs and the livelihood of our employees?